Hi you guys, it's Chelsea. I know the holidays can be really crazy, and you might not have time to get around to watching some of your favorite holiday films, so I'm here to give you a quick recap of the classics so that you know what to talk about at your next holiday party. Here's Love Actually. Okay, so this movie is about a bunch of people and they're all like in love and stuff. First, there's an old British singer dude who like had sex with Britney Spears once. But like, who hasn't, right? And then Jamie finds out his brother is sleeping with his girlfriend, so he runs away to a cottage in France, obviously, where then there's this Portuguese housekeeper and she takes her clothes off and jumps in the pond, so then Jamie tries to learn Portuguese for her. Because obviously, it's when a woman takes her clothes off is when you know you love her. Daniel's wife died and his stepson's all like, mm not even really sad about mom because I'm in love with this girl at school. And Daniel's like, uh, you're 10, asshole. And then Daniel's friend Karen is married to Harry and they have two kids and one's a lobster. And then Harry buys a secretary a necklace and Karen just gets this Joni Mitchell CD and she's like, well, fuck, I already have this one. Or at least I imagine that's why she's upset. Maybe it's because her husband gave a necklace to another woman. That's actually why she's upset. And then Sarah works for Harry and she's in love with Carl, but no one really cares about the storyline if we're being honest. And then John and Judy are stand-ins and they're naked a lot, but actually the storyline blows too. Then Julia marries Peter, but his best friend Mark is in love with Juliet and she watches this video of her wedding and it turns out to be like creepy stalker footage you took of her. But then later on it's fine and she makes out with him after he professes his love to her on cue cards. Because it's like a totes normal thing and not at all creepy. <laughs> Colin's this weirdo who's like around, but no one really understands why. I'd probably sleep with him though. I'd definitely sleep with him. And then Karen's brother is a prime minister, and Natalie works for him, and everyone's like calling her chubby all the time, and it's like, relax everyone, she's not fucking chubby, god! And then they talk about their feelings in a car with an octopus in between them, and it's like, real cute. And then everyone's in the airport at the end making out, including extras we don't really care about, and then they all turn into boxes on the screen, and it gets tiny, and then turns into a heart, the end. Honestly, this movie kind of fucking sucks. Does anyone like this movie? So there you have it, Love Actually. Now you'll be able to talk to your Aunt Karen about it all night.